the King Edward Bridge at Newcastle on Tyne. An l and r locomotive, it's a train of Great Western stock, probably a direct service from the Tyne to the West Country. Gem. This is a run round of the Newcastle upon Tyne system taken from a flat wagon being propelled by a locomotive. We're coming in on the route from the south and are about to cross the same bridge that we've just seen, the King Edward. Here's a brief glimpse of what was then known as the Coley Tyne. Here's a view of the high level and swing bridges. This was claimed to be the largest and most complex railway junction in the world back in 1930, with lines coming in from the left from Carlisle and Hexham the industrial area of Scotswood. And here is a rare glimpse of a northeastern Sentinel steam rail car, probably on the service to Pontyland. Approaching the castle, the line on the right recrosses the Tyne towards Gateshead. Now comes another rare scene, the oldest electrification scheme introduced by a British mainline company, the famous northeastern Tyneside Electrics, started in 1904. This is one of the original trains. It was a third rail system on 600 volts DC. This station is called Manners. The tracks on the left go off to Gosforth as we follow the East Coast Main Line. 